Hi, welcome to Verse of the Day. My name is Brandon, and I preach at the West Side Church of Christ in Ellensboro, Kentucky, and I want to thank you for joining me. I hope everybody has a blessed day today, and today we are entering into the book of Luke. So we are in Luke chapter 1. Luke chapter 1, and I'm going to go ahead and just read the first four verses, because here in the first four verses, he gives the reason for what he is writing, why he's writing, you know, um, and why he's writing it the, the way he is. And so I think it's good to, to read and look at and consider as, as we make our study through the book of Luke. And so here in verse 1, it says, Inasmuch as many undertaken to compile an account of the things accomplished among us. And so just look at that first verse, you know. He says, many, as many have undertaken to compile an account of the miracles, the teachings, the crucifixion of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Again, I know we have Matthew, Mark, Luke, and then John. But you have to take into consideration how many other people, if they saw the miracles taking place and everything else that had gone on, how many more people were probably writing their view of how things have gone on? So he says, as much as everybody else has, I've decided to do this too. Verse 2 says, just as they were handed down to us by those from the beginning were eyewitnesses and servants of the word. And so verse 2 is telling us here that as we study the Old Testament, that those and these other accounts, they are eyewitnesses. They witnessed these things to themselves. And they wrote them down. That's how we trust them. Again, these were people who lived and saw these things take place. And verse 3 says, It seemed fitting for me as well, having investigated everything carefully from the beginning to write it out for you in consecutive order, most excellent the Theophilus, so that you may know the exact truth about the things you have been taught. So here... He brings out the point, it seemed fitting for me to do this also. After having what? Not just because he, he was there. He says after investigating, after researching and studying and looking into it even more, everything carefully from the beginning to write it out in a consecutive order. And so, so we, we look and we can study it and see that it, it flows from the beginning to the end of the life of our Lord that he writes it in that kind of order so that we can really concept the order in which it took place. And it says, why, why does he do these things? So that you may know the exact truth about the things you have been taught. So that we may know the truth of the things that has been written down for us. And so uh, it's a, a wonderful thing that, again, he, he was compelled to do, um, inspired to do by the Holy Spirit. And so we, we are got to be grateful for that, and so let us look forward as we start our study through the book of Luke um, and the time that we're going to spend into it, spend in it. So I want to thank you again for joining me. I hope everybody has a blessed day today, and if the uh, Lord is willing.